After a fast start and a disappointing end to last year's Women's Six Nations, Wales captain Rachel Taylor is hoping to lead her team to a more consistent performance at this year's tournament. Rachel, last year's Six Nations started out fantastically. It then didn't quite go to plan. What changes have you made this year? I think rather than changes, it's trying to expose ourselves to different experiences and different situations. I think we couldn't have asked for a better start of the last tournament, um, which was obviously quite special for us to have a home victory against England first as well, which was huge. Um, probably for us, there's a slight role reversal in that we've always been the underdogs and to have the pressure put on us was, was unusual for us. Um, so it's a case of trying to expose ourselves with a sort of a higher intensity regional programme and through the sevens girls being away and experiencing sort of the pressures that come with sevens, trying to influence our sort of team mindset almost. So, you know, it's, we're not going to improve in those situations until we can expose ourselves to them more frequently and I think that we're trying to do that. Um, but obviously a lot of lessons learned as far as mindset and, and taking each game at a time comes. I think for us, you know, it is important to start well, but for me it's probably more consistency within games. Um, you know, if you look at it World Cup wise, we have to have a minimum of two games, you know, to win. But we've got three home games this season, which is, you know, it's, it's obviously it's nice when the tournament comes around. You've got three home games. It's obviously an advantage to have that. Um, but it also gives an opportunity to play against England Ireland away, where maybe they would be the more pressure games for us. But you know, without it being a home fixture and too much pressure on us, hopefully we'll perform well away from home. And your role as captain. I mean, what will you be saying to, to rally the troops? Yeah, you know, the, the girls are a pretty determined bunch as they are, you know, it's, it's not really a case of me sort of jeering them up or anything. I think it's more sort of refocusing and, and, and challenging ourselves. A lot of what we're doing now is quite player-led and, and, you know, we target things and we split them off and we, we talk about it a lot more than we have before and I think it's having that sort of almost communi communication link between the players and the sort of the, the key um, decision makers within the game. You know, we, we all need to be on the same page and I think, you know, that, I think we're getting to that point now where, where we all have the same sort of focus.